I never thought our first date would be our worst date. <laughs> we barely spoke. We had some expensive food and some expensive cheesecake, but that was it. We didn't talk for a while after, but I knew there was something special about you. We actually hit it off and ended up hanging out literally every day. I would try so hard to make you laugh and I still do. You won't admit it, but you knew I was hilarious when you saw me spray the perfume on me thinking it was something else and then saying I messed up and my mom was going to think I was with some girl. You were the funniest girl I had ever met. You're my friend, you're my best friend. You cried when I left and I felt like I was going to lose a friend. Thankfully I did. I left for the army and I remember telling everyone you were my girlfriend. You weren't yet. <laughs> we wrote, but most importantly, you wrote me. You gave me a chance and it was the only chance I've, I could have ever asked for and been rewarded with. You saw me with my bald head and my uniform and fell in love. I had to make you my girlfriend while I had the chance. You said yes, and we've had the experience that most people will never understand. They've only seen us for our smiles and our laughs, but we've struggled through our problems, our arguments and our disagreements, but we've never forgotten always stick by each other's side. You came into my life at exactly the right time, when I wasn't ready, and yet I needed your love the most. I didn't fall in love with you, I walked into love with you, with my eyes wide open, choosing to take every step along the way. I do believe in fate and destiny, but I also believe we are only fated to do the things that we choose. And I choose you, in a hundred lifetimes, in a hundred worlds, in any version of reality, I'd find you and I'd choose you. You are my hero, my best friend, my second stomach, <laughs> my forever. How awesome is our God to bring us together during a time in our lives with many hurdles. You have held my hand through every doctor's appointment, encouraging me to keep moving forward when the answer was no. Every diagnosis, yes, all 5,000 of them, and always ensuring me that when we were together, all of the pain was gonna be swapped for smiles and laughter. I know loving someone with a chronic illness isn't easy, but your ability to do it effortlessly never ceases to amaze me. And I want to thank you for that. You're my rock. We've had 20 goodbyes in the last two and a half years. Every single goodbye encouraged us to look forward to this very day. I can't remember how many times we would say, oh, only three more goodbyes until the wedding. And I can't wait to finally go home with you as your wife. Although we have our biggest goodbye in April, I know wholeheartedly that we can get through anything, and I'm so proud of you. I promise to take care of you through sickness and through health, and you know I have and I always will. I promise to support you no matter what. I promise that you are the most beautiful woman. I promise to take you to Taco Bell, after we said we wouldn't go, but you changed your mind. I promise to make you the happiest woman in the world. I promise that I'll put you above myself in every circumstance. I promise that I love you, Hayden. You're the greatest thing to happen to me, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. You're my greatest supporter. You always place others' needs above your own. You're the definition of a selfless person, and for that, I'm grateful. Hayden Clark, thank you for our first worst date. Thank you for making me the best man I can be and still continue to be. I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you, Hayden. I love you. I promise to be your last worst first date ever. I promise to always do Grinch impersonations, even in the middle of summer. Dinner with my shelf at Chips, I can't cancel that again. <laughs> <laughs> I promise to always love Jesus first, you second, and our family third. I promise to always be your little mama. I promise to always say yes to Taco Bell. And yes, it'll always be my idea. <laughs> I promise to support you through every low and every high. 
and when perfect love casts out fear, I promise to stand beside you today, tomorrow, and always. Thank you for always being you. I couldn't be happier to stand beside you in front of God, our friends, and our family. You have blessed my life in more ways than you could ever imagine. Here's to forever, baby, I love you.